first out of the kit and uh, and sort of get ready for it. Um, so it's really uh, really filling up now and uh, various some starts going off at uh, various some stages, people warming up and um, so uh, it's going to be a good day, it's going to be a good run for the sites, just being uh, cautious, uh, not be heroic and just do what uh, you have to do and um, run within you, uh, what I say, parameters. Um, uh, you know, run within yourself. Um, you know your pace, you know what you've actually trained for, so uh, uh, that's the way to really uh, do it. Um, you know, it's, uh, it is about uh, being economical with your training and uh, if you're only in a course on a day like this, you're actually going to sweat out anything. Um, so uh, hydration is uh, high on the list. So uh, let's see what we can do on this one. And uh, as I say, it's uh, <coughs> not about time. It's not about uh, being best. It's not about uh, anything really. It's just really part of the build of part of the training run, part of what we've uh, got scheduled for the next race. <laughs> you know, if this is not going to be a good race, just think about the next one. Use this as a train run, and this is what it is, a train run. And so we've um, finished. Um, uh, it's about 61 minutes uh, according to the watch. Um, don't know what the official time is, but uh, I probably don't really want to. Um, not the sort of greatest 10k ever, but uh, having said that, um, it's the first race in eight months um, since we had a bit of a disaster at Birmingham. <coughs> um, but having said that, it's running well. Um, it's a really hot day, uh, not really conditions to do anything, uh, as I say, heroic. Um, so it's more sort of tactical, basically from say A to B. And uh, that's what we've done. Um, so very really more um, working towards the heart rate. Um, I haven't really done that before. Um, rather than running to a pace, actually running to uh, a heart rate, um, the first 5k. Uh, about 138, 140, that felt really good. Um, so I kept me in check and uh, kept a nice sort of uh, easy pace going, so I'm um, really pleased with that. Um, it sort of shot up a little bit as I got to 5k, and I think Grace's plan was really to look at the first 5k and, and see if it was possible to actually do a negative split, uh, run easy out, then um, try and put a bit of effort in the way back. Um, tried. And um, probably uh, just off the pace a little bit, I think towards getting back in town, really, uh, really got hot and um, just exhausted, and um, and you know just have to walk. Uh, I think last mile was a bit of a struggle. Uh, it's, you know, it's got to be hilly, and the heart rate really sort of shot up to uh, you know, yeah, one sort of sixty, one six threes, and probably higher than that. So. You could see feel that fatigue, uh, definitely in the red zone, and um, uh, the lactate sort of building up in the, le in the legs and just sort of tiring out. Um, on the whole, I'm, I'm not disappointed. Um, it wasn't about time, it was a, uh, a good run. Um, uh, what I can take from this is, um, yeah, just look at the, um, the training that's going at the moment because it's working. Um, you know, first half was good, the first four was really good, so solid running. Um, could have gone faster, on a better day it would have been faster. But there again, it's the way it happens. Um, but really pleased. Um, I can't complain with uh, what we've done today. I've enjoyed it, it's a nice day's running. Um, great crowds, great crowd support. You know, the sun's got people out. Um, 8,000 people running around the streets of Birmingham. Yeah, it's uh, 
I guess that's what about. So there are a lot of positives. Um, definitely no negatives with me. Um, a few people may sort of uh, rise up, raise their eyebrows about the time. So um, that's, that's their problem, not mine. I know I did it. I know how I finished and how I'm feeling right now. So um, that's the way it is. So. Uh, yeah, not a bad day at the office, uh, not a brilliant day at the office, but an okay day at the office and um, lots to work on, but we're going in the right direction. So, um, yeah, yeah, time to relax, get a beer and chill out.